Hello, and welcome back to Books Central Inside the Pages. I'm your host, Abby, and today we have a fascinating topic lined up for you. Joining me is John Friedman, a distinguished lecturer in writing, to delve into the intricate art of incorporating a character's backstory into a novel. Welcome, John. Thank you, Abby. It's a pleasure to be here. So, let's dive right in. When we talk about incorporating a character's backstory into a novel, where do we begin? Well, Abby, the backstory of a character is like the foundation of a building. It shapes who they are, why they act the way they do, and what motivates them. As writers, it's crucial to understand the how, when, where, and what of integrating this backstory seamlessly into the narrative. Absolutely. Can you elaborate on the how aspect? Certainly. The technique and style of revealing the character's backstory. It can be done through direct exposition, dialogue, flashback sequences, or even through the character's actions and reactions in the present. The key is to find a balance that feels organic to the story without overwhelming the reader with too much information at once. So, when is the best time to include the backstory? Timing is everything. Revealing the character's backstory at the right moment can deepen the reader's understanding and empathy towards the character. It's essential to weave it into the narrative at points where it enhances the tension, adds depth to relationships, or drives the plot forward. So, timing is crucial. Now, any advice on where in your novel you should add the backstory? The answer to that question is it could be integrated seamlessly into the main narrative, explored in separate chapters, or sprinkled throughout the story. The key is to avoid disrupting the flow of the narrative while still providing essential insights into the character's past. And finally, let's discuss the what should be included. Ah, the what question, this involves the content of the character's backstory. It should reveal key elements of their personality, motivations, fears, and desires. However, it's essential not to reveal everything at once. Leaving some aspects of the characters past shrouded in mystery can create intrigue and keep the reader engaged. That's excellent advice, John. Do you have any examples of novels that effectively incorporate a character's backstory? Certainly. One example is Harper Lee's To Kill a Mockingbird. The gradual revelation of Atticus Finch's past, particularly his experiences as a lawyer and his unwavering moral compass adds depth to his character and enriches the novel's central themes. And are there any pitfalls that writers should avoid when incorporating backstory? Absolutely. One common mistake is info dumping, where the writer dumps large amounts of backstory all at once, disrupting the flow of the narrative. Another pitfall is an irrelevant backstory that doesn't contribute to the character's development or the plot. It's essential to be selective and only include a backstory that serves the story's purpose. Wise words, John. Thank you so much for joining me today and sharing your insights into the art of incorporating a character's backstory into a novel. It was my pleasure, Abby. Thank you for having me. And that's a wrap for this episode of Books Central Inside the Pages. Join us next time for another insightful discussion on all things literature. Until then, happy reading!